J -j -j -j, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. CodingPhase.com, your boy's back and out and did it again. Guys, let's talk about it. <laughs> so today, Bitcoin definitely uh, broke the record. And it's pretty high right now, right? Now, this is one of those things and one of those moments that make you happy and make you sad at the same time. All right, so let me give you my little history with Bitcoin. All right, I bought Bitcoin when it was about, let me see, when was it? Uh, it was like around here, 700 and something dollars, right? I bought it at 700 something dollars. I had two Bitcoins. I bought two Bitcoins, um, you know, last year, all right? And then basically, I was riding the wave, riding the wave, riding the wave until this year, summertime, right? And for whatever reason, we got to 2300 So I had like a four, about like $4,600 or something like that. Yeah, like $4,600, almost $4,700, right? And then there was a big drop. And it was a huge drop. I mean, to me, it was a huge drop. I was like, man, that's like six hundred dollars that you know that went down this past week, whatever, this past few days. So when it dropped, I caught uh, like I don't know, I don't know. I caught something, <laughs> you know. I got nervous or something. I sold it. I was like, man, I don't have the heart for this. I I can't really deal with this up and down. I mean, cause you know. People might talk about it and be like, oh, man, $2,000, that's nothing. You know, people got a freaking twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 into Bitcoin. And it's like, yeah, you got twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 into Bitcoin. But those twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 is, you know, it's like 5% of the money that you have saved. You know what I mean? Like, I don't have that much money saved. Like, you know, I got a good, a good amount, but not enough to be saying, hey, I'm going to be throwing away four thousand dollars in the air like that you know what i mean like i don't know I, I i come from the bottom man and like i still give value to money you know what i mean like that's how i look at it so i sold it i sold it right and i also at that time i was gonna move out from the apartment that uh the house that i'm living on right now and i sold it and then whatever it dropped and then it came back up slowly but surely. I said, you know what? I'm not even going to look at Bitcoin, man. And, you know, I, I stopped looking at it. And then it got up to here, right? And I said, man, my money would have doubled right there, man. You know? <laughs> and then the other day, I was like, oh, cool. You know what? I should buy again. And it was on this time, exactly on this time, September 14th. I was like, yo, I'm about to just buy, you know, a one Bitcoin. Just for the hell of it, just to have it here. You never know what's going to happen. Now, today it goes all the way up, man. You know, right now it's at $6,388. And I'm thinking in my head, man, you know, that would have been $4,000 that I would have had invested. No, I actually would have had gotten, I invested $1,400. That's how much I invested into, into Bitcoin. And that fourteen hundred dollars would have been twelve thousand dollars right now in like one year of like investment, right? And that's if I wouldn't, if I would have just kept it there, because I also, if, when I think about, it, I'm like, man, if I would have just put in fifty dollars every week or hundred dollars every week, like who knows where my money would be at right now, right? But man, <laughs> there's like one of those moments, man, where I tell you guys, yo, just buy it, man. Just buy it. Leave it alone. We don't know where Bitcoin is going to go. We don't know where Ethereum is going to go. I mean, Ethereum is seems pretty. I'll be honest. Ethereum, I don't even know if I would tell people, hey, buy this. Just because it seems pretty whack. There's like, there's no money to be made with this people keep saying like oh it's gonna go up you know next year and this this and that i don't know there's like a a wish list right so today i decided i said you know what i'm gonna buy i'm gonna buy today you know half a bitcoin right you know half a bitcoin i bought that and then i bought 
one Bitcoin, one Bitcoin, not one Bitcoin, one Ethereum coin, whatever, whatever you call them. But man, I'm really pissed right now. <laughs> you know what it is to have fourteen hundred dollars invested into something, and you could have literally. I took it out to make like five hundred dollars. <laughs> in profit i mean like 500 dollars in profit i could have just left it there and literally had today twelve thousand dollars like that's crazy now what i'm doing is i just say i put this automatically i say you know what let's just leave this automatically and you know let coinbase just buy fifty dollars per week I was gonna go fifty dollars daily, but that's a little bit ridiculous. So I'm just gonna put fifty dollars per week and just forget about it. You know, let them charge me weekly fifty dollars. That's like two hundred dollars per month. That's fine. If it grows, it grows. If it doesn't, it doesn't. It's the same thing as my Betterment, uh, Betterment account. Like, who cares? You know what I mean? Like, oh, man. But I'm really pissed right now, man. I I'm wondering, like. Out of all of you guys, man, you know, I also have Coinbase, I have TD Bank, I have Invest on Acoins, which just takes like little change from here and there. I also have Betterment, I also have, uh, what else? I, I had Robinhood, but I sold all my stocks. I don't want, I don't want to deal with the stock market because you got to be on top of that all the time. And I just don't have time. I hate it. So I like things that's automatic, right? And it's just like I'm investing money into it, but I'm leaving it there and just like forget about it. All right. Now, I'm just wondering, like, from all of you guys, who here actually buying Bitcoins and Ethereum coins and Litecoins and the whole shebang? Like, I would like to see who's actually here buying into it. Let me know. Leave a comment below. It's your boy Joe back at it again. Codingface.com. And yeah, <laughs> I'll see you guys again. Bye.